Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Pastor J. Carter of the Change Church, and I'm jumping online to hit you all with another video. So I wanted to come online and tell you that it is not the problem that defines who you are as a person. It's not the problem that actually defines your character. It's how you choose to solve it that actually defines your character. So a lot of us have been holding on to things that no longer serve us. I want to encourage you to let it go. I want to encourage you to let it go. It happened it hurt. It could be embarrassing. It could be shameful. But I want to encourage you to let it go and take a step at moving forward. Whether it is a person, whether it is a marriage, whether it is a, uh, a job, whether it is anything that is no longer serving you, it is best for you to let it go. Anything that's causing you to second guess, to doubt, let it it go. It is not the problem that defines you. No one's going to say, you know what? This person, you know, got divorced. This person went to the crazy house. This person filed for bankruptcy. This person was in prison. This person, that's not your story. That's not the end of your story, right? You need to make sure that your end of your story is victory. The end of your story is success. The end of your story is never giving up. The end of the story is yes, the divorce happened. Yes, the breakup happened. Yes, I lost someone very close to me. Yes, I was in a mental institution. Yes, I did go to prison. But the end result is I'm a successful business owner. I'm a successful mother. I was able to get remarried and, and now I'm a, 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 a better husband. I was able to grow from that experience. So I want to encourage you to keep pushing keep growing don't quit don't give up right now because it's not the problem that defines you it's how you choose to solve it how you choose to move forward what you choose to learn from it because i can guarantee you this real talk that problem other people have those same problems so why don't you teach the next generation how to move past that thing i'm out Oh, no. Grab your water. Make your to-do list. And don't forget, hit a sit-up or two. It ain't gonna hurt.